Hey, great to have you along at mid-morning on WKYT. As many parents know, not all children learn in the same way. A school here in Lexington specializes in teaching children with learning differences, and they're going to be holding a special literary showcase. We're joined by Beverly Henderson from Core Academy and Marty Walker, the author of the book being showcased. And we do welcome you both. Glad to have you here today. Hey, thank you. Actually, a couple of books with more on the way. Yeah, the writer and the illustrator. But first, let's ask Beverly about uh, the Core Academy and what it is and does. Um, the Core is a school for kids that, um, as you mentioned, learn differently. We have kids who have learning disabilities and maybe um, reading issues, or we have also kids with anxiety. We have a lot of kids who struggle with ADHD and some kids with autism. But um, it's basically, it's very small. It's a school that's um, kind of a family atmosphere that kind of takes kids and helps them figure out where their strengths are. So tell us about this literary showcase that you have coming up. We have um, the showcase is Thursday, mm -hmm. and um, the theme is um, literature takes you out of this world. And the kids have been working, everything we do, their art has been with this theme, their music. So they're going to showcase what they've learned and the books that they've had. Well, very good. And Marty, you have two books here. I do. Right? I do. Yeah, tell mm -hmm. us about You wrote and, uh, and also uh, illustrated. illustrated those. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mr. Moody's a racehorse, a baby racehorse that changes colors with his moods and feelings. Um, the books are designed to encourage children to talk about their moods and feelings and their needs. And, and um, hopefully, um, um, what they need um, mm -hmm. through it. Plus, there's a monthly calendar that they can draw and you can watch for patterns on um, how they're acting, if they've gone to a daycare, or they've gone mm -hmm. to school, or if they've gone somewhere. Have you seen some children interact uh, with the book? I have tested on 48 children. Yeah, yes. how does that go? <laughs> have, um, Do you see been, light bulbs go off? Yes, a lot of light bulbs. And one little girl, sh her brother was going through uh, leukemia really bad, and she just had all these pastel colors. And I said, Katie, you're just so happy. All your colors are so happy, and your brother's so sick. And he said, she said, well, He's alive, isn't he? So <laughs> they don't yeah. think like we do. Kids, kids make a lot of sense, yes, too, they don't do. they? <laughs> and so important, I would think, to make sure that the, the family is involved with the kids in things like this. Our school relies heavily on parent support um, because we are small, we're private. Um, the parents, you know, pay tuition and fund, but they also um, support us in the classroom. They volunteer and run our office, and so. Um, pulling the parents in to let them know, you know, this is what we found works best with this child and this is a way they can communicate as well. Well, the uh, event is coming up March 30th, 6 o'clock. It is free, coreacademy.org for more information about what you do. Thanks yeah. for coming. Thank Thanks you. So Thanks for having us. And Mr. Moody has more adventures on the way. <laughs> yes. He does. No yes. All right. yes, his birthday book will be coming out in June. Very yeah. good.